Fun Fact Friday. Taken in 1934, a photo shows what appears to be the slender neck of an animal rising from the surface of the water. From the moment it was published in the London Daily Mail, it became the very image of the Loch Ness Monster and, for many, the strongest evidence that Nessie actually exists. The photo was sold to the Daily Mail by a London physician named R. Kenneth Wilson, who said he had taken the picture when he noticed a commotion in the water as he was driving up from London to photograph birds with his friend near Inverness. But could the sightings in the 1930s have been of an elephant from a traveling circus instead? Circuses were a common occurrence in this area, particularly in the 1930s. This traveling circus fair visited Inverness would often stop on the banks of Loch Ness to give their animals a rest. They would allow the elephants to swim, wash, and play in the water. As you know, when elephants are under the surface, they stick their trunks out so that they can breathe. When their elephants were allowed to swim in the loch, only the trunk and two humps could be seen, the first hump being the top of the head and the second being the back of the animal. The trunk and humps in the water would bear similarities to some of the most famous Nessie photographs. Gigi has lots of Nessies under their care. You can see who they are if you click on the link in the bio.